Hello YouTube team, Uchiko here, and I am back with this gloriously tall system. If you did not see this, then just, well, click it. <laughs> click the gigantic tower to go to the last video. Spent a good 30 seconds just saying that. <laughs> and... I will show what each of these command blocks, besides the bottom one, does. Except briefly. The bottom one summons in a gigantic, uh, gigantic tower of, uh, of falling sand, as you can see right here. Seven, seven falling sand, ten blocks above. Yeah. And then it's so big that it does not even fit in the chat. And I never noticed this. There's a little scroll thing over here. I never noticed that. Wait, does it function? What the? I don't even know. But, uh... Yeah, each one of those represents a block. <laughs> Fun. So, that does not include these exterior ones, because those, those exterior ones are actually one of these. I'll show you what I mean later. This right here is part of a fill clock, a set block clock that is. What the set block clock is, it goes, does a kill command which kills all these. Subsequently it also kills any item around it, so don't be throwing anything around here. Uh, this summons an item and the item, this whole toboggle, is a stick named branch. Bunch of random crap for a stick. So yes, if I just if I just stand here, I will just get my inventory filled with with branches. Here, this is a scoreboard player set at each type is equals item branch one, and it makes and the the item has to be a skull with a damage of three. The skull with the damage of three. If I go over here to the decoration blocks, as you can see, the three. That means that it is a damage value of three, and it got killed. <laughs> so yeah. And then the UID. This is a teleport, which teleports. Shut up. Anything with a branch score of two. Uh, well, one thing, that's the C equals 1 over here, to, uh, <laughs> uh, to, and to another one, which is only 1, and I also have it set to only 1, oops, uh, now, I honestly don't remember where the command block is that, oh, here it is, <laughs> scroll player set, uh, basically this just sets the, no, that's to set it one. Yeah, I honestly don't know where the one, uh, is it over here? No, it's a, it's a kill, and, yeah, here it is. Uh, this is the one that's setting, that's what's responsible for setting these to a score of one. So yes, it uses scores of 1 and 2 if I dash scoreboard objectives. Actually, let me do a list. It only generates a uh, branch, but now if I do uh, uh, set display sidebar branch, as you can see, it's a whole bunch of crap. And now if I just get rid of that, because that's lagging the hell out of me. God damn. Giddy the goddamn. <laughs> so that's what these four do. I believe I explained each one. You know, I do the formal format. Kill the stick. Yeah. This is just the end of the uh, thing. So this right here is what's responsible for, a, for the whole bit of clock. Now, what this does. Uh, so when. When, <clears throat> when this spawns. It spawns with a redstone block above it, but that redstone block is uh, deleted because that activates it, 
and it sets it to it makes an error. So it says instantly destroyed. And then this one, which sets it to a redstone block. I probably could have done that just by putting a redstone block on top of it. Well, it puts a redstone block in the middle and that starts everything up. Then this one is the same one I just went. That's a redstone block. Apparently clicking on it makes you lag. <laughs> uh, this is the command block that sets one of these. Uh, it is the one that scoreboards for the skull. This just makes the scoreboard. This one makes uh, one, makes the kill block. This one... What is this one? <laughs> it summons an item... Oh yeah, this is the uh, summon item. And then this... Is the teleport one. Ah! This stone block here is... Uh, so this clock can function, and this is just to show that it's a clock. Oof! Okay, about to say that lags and destroys the command. Actually, that's an irrelevant command block. But that's a different story. Yeah, <laughs> there's nothing in that one. Uh, and this is another fill clock, and that's the same thing as below. This executes at uh, any branch to kill the skull, which is why the skull. And the branches are there in the same spot for one twentieth of a second. Yeah, you can never see that. <laughs> uh, this sets uh, all the branches to two, as I already explained. Now this. You might be wondering, why is it blank? Why would I bother putting one blank there? It's not originally blank. If I could... When we get up to it, I, and that's the set for the redstone, uh, let's see... That's to set one of the blocks. That's to set another block. Now, here's the interesting one. This, set the command block right here. That summons an armor stand underneath it. So, why? Well, so it looks cool, the armor stands just like falling down in the same area as the branches and they, it just smacks into the command block. And... Visual effects. <laughs> Highly necessary. And then, a bunch of blocks later, because this was all completely necessary, I swear to god. I want it to be 150, I couldn't get it to 150, I said, you know what, I'm not putting in like a half slab or something annoying to make it work upside down, I don't even know how it would work. But, I'm not going through that, why would I? This just sets a command block there, instead of the air, I want it to be visually represented where it was. And now this is a spread players that spreads over 1000 by 1000 by 1000. And then the average distance between each uh, armor stand is 74 blocks apart. And after 10, I have no idea what the fuck that means. <laughs> just, to be frank, hi, I'm Frank, how are you? Uh, I have no idea what the hell that means. I'm not good with spread players. All I know is that each branch cannot be uh, 10 blocks close to each other. Let's, I have no idea how the fuck it works. Uh, false, because there's no team. Uh, and the at E is the armor stand. Now, this only activates once. This one executes at the armor stand, except block command, which is Minecraft skull. With a damage value of 1. I uh, don't know why I have a damage value of 1 to be perfectly Skype get out of here. To be perfectly honest. It is a skull type of 3. Which is the play ahead. Rotation of 0. That way it's facing you. And the extra type is RFX. RFS, RSFX. What that means. Is. It is. Simply. The. If you weren't watching the last video, I can just give myself that head. This is RFX, RFX's head. It's a little bush. I really think they should like make it so it has its own breaking animation. Is the that would be amazing? I would love that. Uh, 
yeah, so that's what that does, it sets it, and then this just kills all the armor stands. Because I've done the math in my head, and there is no way that you can manage to make an armor stand in that little amount of time that you have. Also, you'll be lagging like a little bit, so. Yep. That's what each and every one of these command blocks does. So, I just have one question for you. Do you want to see it again? Whether you say yes or no, you know what you're doing? Seeing it again. I think if I break this one first, it... nope, doesn't kill. Whatever. Yep, just gonna... Yeah, you have. if you want to get rid of the system, you have, you have to manually break every single one of these command blocks. Well, not every single one, just all the clocks. But who wants all these things in their world? Especially all this freaking stone. You, you're free to destroy the stone if you want. I have no problem with that. But, uh, yeah, I recommend that you don't get too close to the system. Because you'll just be, have an inventory full of six in like a minute. So push the button, and... Now, if you notice, it actually places the blocks relatively slow. And then... If I could, yeah, see that? That's all the armor stands. And they're drilling into the command. I, always, I just like it. And now we can catch up to this. It lags out for a moment. That's a lot of stone. And now all the armor stands are gone. And look, this one right there. As you can see, it made a new, a uh, new little brand, uh, bush. I wonder if there's one around here somewhere. That, oh, there's two over here. Clearly, these were from different systems, because they can't possibly be this close to each other. Now, this does make it so seeds may appear randomly in the world. Nothing I can really do about that, and I don't know why I went into this place. Yeah, there's nothing I can uh, do about the seeds or flower thing. If it gets spread there, it gets spread, spread there. It'll never replace like any major block, because it is a spread player. But, whatever. Remember how last time I said this would be a longer video? Yeah, I was wrong. Damn. Maybe I should fall for like... 9 or 10 minutes and ooh, this is interesting. Wonder why it went there. Huh. Maybe the vines? I was debating summoning it, uh, summoning it with uh, no AI instead of uh, oh, no AI or no gravity, so it would just float there. But I decided against it. Maybe I should implement that. Mm, nah. If you don't know what no AI is, it does. I always make three M's. Now you might be saying, Wither Boss, why are you mentally insane? Well, a little bit. Ender Dragon, I'd be a little insane. Because the Ender Dragon still destroys blocks. No AI. One. And. Weather. Weather statue. Does it make everything darker? I know that it has an effect on everything. Ooh. Now, I'm just. Now, if I just. Uh, dash game mode. That's. Weather. Hey. Hey, weather. Hey. Hey, weather. Nothing. Now, when the boss dies, yay! Another star. Yeah, no AI is great. I was debating doing no AI. Wait, was there another one? What? I'm going insane. <laughs> I was debating doing no AI or no gravity because uh, an armor stand with, uh, I believe an armor stand with no AI uh, is the same thing. No, actually no, an armor stand with no AI doesn't function like that. Uh, an armor stand with no gravity though, just stands there. I was debating doing that, but I decided against it for some reason. And I'm too lazy to stall more. <laughs> I may or may not be telling the truth about that. That I was attempting to stall. I really was. It's sad. <laughs> it's 
so shorter video that an explanation of all these blocks was a shorter video than me going around the world and punching one bush. Yay. So, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. It really helps me if you do. It shows other people my videos and Dancing Spider. So if you enjoyed, leave a like. It's very much appreciated. And I know that you guys tend to like these redstone videos more. So, you know, if you want to see more redstone videos, I have another idea coming. And it's actually going to be a kind of fun one to toy around with. It's going to be a little difficult on my part. And I'm going to be making a couple different versions of it. One that you have to, like, one just that's there that you would have to place in yourself. And another one that's in one command block. But the one that's in one command block will probably come later. Because this took me about a month. I was working on it a long time ago. I was working on it back in, like... 14W, like, tw not 20, no, definitely not 20, like 12 or something stupid. Maybe 17? I think it was 17 that I started. Yeah, I've been working on this for a stupidly long time. I gave up on it for a while because I was like, because they, for a while they had changed it so uh, heads didn't want to be placed right and nothing was working. But, they changed everything, and now everything works. But, as I already said, that will be, actually, did I even say it? That will be it for this video, by another star. I hope you all enjoyed. Leave a like, and I'm out. Pais! Yes, the Pais have been lower, key. I'm a little sick. Is it because of you, Sam? Did you get me sick? I knew you were sick. <laughs> Sam's my dog, if you didn't know. He's sound asleep. Cute when he's asleep. Not so much when he's awake. <laughs> I'm stalling again. Yeah. You might have been able to notice, but I'm a little sick. Which is why I haven't had that many videos. I was actually too sick to uh, render the Agrarian Skies for Monday. And I don't have one for this Monday. I might be able to get it done over the weekend, but... Uh, I don't think you guys really missed it. If you did miss it, tell me. I'd like a little support. <laughs> but... Okay. I've stalled enough. <sighs> That's it for this video. I'm out. Secondary pie, yes. I heard a little. Oh, and as soon as I said it, it lagged. Yeah, I heard a little bit. Whatever. Well,